Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. So a bunch of you have actually wrote in and said, can you do some more obscure string that's not mainstream? Well, I got one today. Stay tuned. All right, coffee sponsor of today is Hunter. Oh, it looks like Hunter became a new member. Uh, Hunter writes, love the videos. Thank you for all the advice. Oh, Hunter, thank you so much. Um, Hunter became a member in which he is now going to hook me up with one coffee a month for a little while and uh, support my coffee habit at least once a month. So Hunter, thank you so, so much for joining the coffee club. If you want to be part of the coffee club sponsorship or hook me up once a month as a member, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. If you want to just hook up the channel and just don't really care about my coffee habit. Super thanks is the way, and you'll be able to support the channel there. All right, thank you so, so much. All right, so a lot of you have wrote in the comments, can you do strings that are not mainstream and, and let us know your opinions about them? So I've been wanting to do like this Weiss Cannon for a while, uh, finally, my buddy, whom I called the Admiral, hello Admiral, uh, basically walked in with this and said, here, you should try this. And I was like, oh, cool. I've been wanting to try this for a while. So it's called Weiss Cannon Ultra Cable. It is a 1.23 millimeters in thickness. Uh, it says, and I'll read it to you, Polythenolphthalate. It's a big word. I don't. I can't read that. Produced with extreme viscosity and strong memory energy, supported by a high-tech four-sided shape, are properties of an incredible. Are properties of incredible power, spin, feeling, and control. You could, you could ever. Excuse me and control you ever could dream of. So it says string main plus cross 1.5 kilograms less than normal copolys. So it wants you to string it a little looser. Interesting. Let's see. Uh, hmm. So this kind of feels familiar. There's a couple strings on the market that's like this. It's very kind of plasticky and definitely on the edgy side because it's probably a square string. It's kind of more like a diamond shaped from the cross section that I can see. I know it's hard to see it, uh, but it, it's kind of like a squarish diamond shaped um, hmm, with edge, with two edges. This is going to be interesting, the string. I wonder if I'll get a manicure out of this. Hopefully I don't bleed. Uh, let's get our racket strung up and uh, we'll see you on the court. So Coach Jared and I just got off the court. Weiss Cannon Ultra Cable. Um, one, two, three. One, two, three. It's called that, one, two, three? That's the gauge. One, two, one, three. three. One, two, three. three. One, point two, three. One, 17, two, three. 17 gauge, right? Yeah. 17? Yeah. Well, I'm a, I'll I let think. you go talk first, man. Go for it. Yeah. So um, the first thing is when I was stringing this string, um, very tough string to string. So 
Um, I'm actually surprised it was a 17 gauge string. So I was telling Harry just now that it felt like uh, 16 or 15. So it's very thick for a 17 gauge string, which is very surprising to me. Um, and yeah, according to Weiss Cannon's description of the string, it is a four sided string. So it's got some serrated edges and feels kind of crisp when you're going through it. Um, and if I'm going to compare this to any other string, Gamma Ocho is the first thing that comes to my mind. Um, so if we're going to the playability part, it's a, actually a super soft string. I was thinking that it's going to be pretty stiff because again, it does have four sides and you'd expect a lot of feel, but it's the complete opposite. And for me, I think it offered okay playability. Um, it was a little bit too soft for my liking. So these days I'm kind of using tour bite. So I'm kind of used to a more stiff and powerful string instead of a more soft and dead poly. Um, but all in all, I think it's just, if you're looking for an arm friendly string that kind of gives you, I guess, just average, you know, average pace and average control. Um, I think this string will probably hit the nail on the head for that. Um, but personally for me, I just don't know if I was a big fan of it in terms of playability and also just the stringing part is also another, another knock. So <laughs> it's kind of a tough one for me, kind of a so, tough one for me. So for you stringers out there, this ain't going to be easy. I, I got like kind of a manicure. When, uh, when I was stringing this, like I, I went like this and I was like, yeah, it was like just ripping through my, the things that I was trying to do this with. And, and it actually hurt my hand that, that I was holding with because it, it's, it's that sharp guys. It's really that sharp. So I tell, I tell stringing companies, make sure it's easy for people to string. Um, I mean, I understand they're trying to make edges, make it soft um impart a lot of spin give it feel um have it pocket and, and give it control at the same time i think they did most of it um it it did pocket very well it did launch very well it did spin very well it's it is definitely in the category of soft powerful uh, when, when I hit my first couple of balls, I literally felt the string like whoop, absorb and then, you know, basically shoot out of there. So, and it did, you know, it did snap. It did snap very, very well. And surprisingly, it dampened very well. It did. Because it's it so did. soft, it dampened really well. It did. So if you're into softer edged, like super edged strings, that'll impart spin, um, I think this would be great for tennis elbow, actually. I think it would. Yeah. I think it would. Definitely one of the more soft strings out on the market. So it's not uh, not too stiff. Not too stiff. Yeah. So if you guys want soft strings, like every, that's like the rising market right now. Everybody's into soft polys. They want the advantage of the soft poly, but they don't want the arm problems of poly. So that's the big growing market right now. And I think that fits right in there. All right. Coach Jared, any final words? Oh, I think you uh, covered the rest. So I think we're good. All right. So if you're in the soft poly, give this Weiss Cannon Ultra Cable a try. Hey, Coach Chris. Hey. You string tennis rackets? That's right. We'll make a little extra cash. Sure. You know, with direct tennis, you can be the official stringer of your own neighborhood. You can set the distance. You can set the meeting place. And you can set the timing. So I can string on a street corner? You can set your own place. It's all at Direct Tennis where they put players with stringers and stringers with players. Check them out at directtennis.online. Link is below. I want to thank Coach Jared for hanging out with me today and uh, risking your fingers to string <laughs> that ultra cable. Where can yeah. they find you, coach? You guys can find me on Instagram at Ma Tennis. All right. Guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.